वेलकम टू बिट फ्यूम्स एंड वी आर ऑन लेरवल क्वेरी बिल्डर ऑसम पैकेज फ्रॉम स्पासी एंड एंड हिज टीम एंड द मेन पर्सन बिहाइंड दिस पैकेज इज फ्रीक सो गो एंड फॉलो फ्रीक फॉलो स्पासी ऑन ट्विटर ही इज वेरी एक्टिव ऑन ट्विटर सो दैट्स कूल इन द लास्ट एपिसोड वी सॉ दैट हाउ वी कैन फिल्टर थिंग्स बट अलॉन्ग विद द फिल्टर देर आर सॉर्टिंग ऑल्सो sorting is like sort by but you don't have to write anything like sort by kind of things you just need to say allow sort so i want to sort by so let's remove this and i just want to say sort and then equal to sign and give the field so sort name but sorting is not done because we have not specified that i want sorting also so i just say allow sort and sorting with name so currently we are getting the result as it is inside the database but now because we have given the sorting by name and we have specified that sort by name and if i now refresh you can see it is all sorted and it says 6793 so it is alphabetically sort what if i just want to reverse this sorting like i want to start from z and then come to a so i can simply say minus here so it's minus name so sort is equal to minus name so hit enter and exactly you can see it is start from the last like it's uh, t here the last one is t then r then r and then at the last we have a so it is now uh, converted into a descending order so let's check if you want to check that what sql query is running behind this so you can just say to sql instead of get so now if i refresh this page the result we are getting is select everything from users order by name descending and if i remove this minus sign from here like this it says name ascending so this is like a magic and it's all behind this query builder package and let's see some of other things so let's go get back to get and then go to the documentation so just like filters this sorting also can be done with multiple things like name and street so name and email you can also include relationships so including relationships is again easy you just need to say include and the relationship name it's like with whenever you are using laravel eloquent you can say like allow include so it will only allow relationship if you specify allow includes so you can see nested uh, relationships are also given and that's cool and let's now see the selecting field you just want to see some of the fields you want from database i don't want everything i don't want created at and updated at i just want name id email and active so i need to say allow fields and fields are like name and email just two things so if i now refresh so we are not getting this why we are not getting because now we need to define that here like just filter we need to say fields so i want the fields so i will say fields is equal to like here we need to say on the users table so users table and then define i want name and email and yes we are getting just name and email so much easy with this query parameter we are changing the result it's extremely useful package not just these things given in this package you can also do if you want the native eloquent things so if i now go and check all these things so you can see we have the email verified null so yes we can directly specify that where email verified at is null so let's see what we are getting so refresh this page and we are getting just two result because two result having email verified at null so yes you can include the query builder functions but also you can use the eloquent where condition and all all of the eloquent things you can include here so this package is very very nice because it allow you to 
filter sort include relationship uh, append attribute selecting field also you can do some paginations if you want to have the pagination like here just give this paginate and then your pagination is done then in, if you want to use this inside your front end there are libraries for view and react and if you don't want you can just pass the data just like this on the query so it's like a query parameter you can pass and it will going to work if you don't want to use these libraries and if you have any problem using this package you can go to the github repository and in this repository you can create an issue just like you can see seven issues are there which will be solved in a next release so you can create a new issue and ask him you can ask me on youtube twitter facebook instagram linkedin and you can follow me on these platforms at bitfumes and sarthak savvy we will meet in some other videos till then goodbye